You know it's always like my favorite day ever when you're doing my glam, right? Thanks so much. <laughs> I know, you're the best. But I want to do like a bright, bold colour because I love a bit of an eye and because it's you, you're the queen of the cat's eye. I'm all for the wing, so let's get a coloured wing eye on now. You have the perfect colouring for red because you've got these amazing blue eyes. I think it brings them out even more. Oh, yay. So not everyone can wear this. <laughs> Christian, we've created quite a few makeup looks together and I've often referred to you as my muse. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but what's your first memory with beauty? I remember that I loved Kylie. I mean, I still love Kylie Minogue. Um, and I had her ultimate Kylie album and she had this like purple pink eyeshadow moment. I remember looking at it and being like, wow, like this is speaking to me. And there was like kind of a matching lip <laughs> moment there. And I just thought that that was like absolutely gorgeous. I mean, I think any form of beauty where it's fashion, hair, makeup, it's kind of a form of identity and it's it's how I choose to express myself in my art form. And that's actually the thing that I like, go to bed thinking about. I'm like, what do I want to do with this look? What do I want to do with my hair and makeup? Like, and that's where I get so excited because I think that it is wearable art on your face and on your body and it, it, that's just so exciting to me. Your eye shape is beautiful because it's elongated. However, it is more you've got a... Um, hood. A hood. Yeah. That's probably the most asked question we get. Hooded eyes, how do you do it? Look forward in a mirror. So don't look down, try and do it, and then look up. I like to sketch it out on the outside mm. and kind of do it to the halfway mark and then meet it and, and follow from the inner eye to the outer eye. I love a bold colour like this because I can go out in a kind of basic outfit like this and still feel cute, or I can be like full glam, full like outfit that's like full of sparkles. That's why I love doing your glam, because not only do you have fun with it, you wear it confidently. And it's and to any occasion. Like this could honestly be to brunch if I had your skills. <laughs> <laughs> What comes first, the makeup or the fit? For me, it's kind of a bit of both. I mean, I'll often go through Instagram and screenshot, as you know, a lot of my favourite makeup looks, and I won't necessarily have an outfit or a event planned for that, but then once something comes up and I sort of know what I'm wearing, I'll scroll back through the things that I really love and pair it together. Yeah, I so love I that. So I suppose it kind of is like a chicken and egg situation, <laughs> like both of them. Yes, they both affect the other one. Yeah. I feel like I could guess this in particular, but what are you loving in the makeup space right now? Well, yeah, you would know because we work together a lot and it's always the same thing, but I love a colourful eye. Really? I, <laughs> I typically, I'm always decked out in colour and I love a like really bright pop of colour on the eyes. And it makes you happy. It makes you happy and it makes other people happy. It does. Every time that I have like a pink eye, not pink eye, <laughs> but of like pink eyeshadow. I have so many people come up to me and be like, oh my gosh, I love it, it's so much fun. I wish I did something like that. And I love that engagement with people as well. So for those at home who have a basic makeup kit, mm -hmm. need to invest in some good makeup, yeah. what is your advice? This is so boring. <laughs> I actually think if you're only gonna invest in one thing, if you're foundation inclined, make it a good one. Because yes. a bad foundation is so bad. And it's just find one that works. It doesn't necessarily need to be expensive, but one that really like matches your skin and goes on well is so important. But also like in terms of something fun. That's what I was gonna say. Yeah. What about a fun product? I love a like glitter liquid eyeliner. Yeah. Me too. It's Me just, too. it's so, and it's so like, you can do different things with it. You can either like just go around the waterline, you can kind of go up a little bit. Sometimes if I'm feeling a bit jazzy, I'll do it on my <laughs> eyebrows. You know, everything that I do, I try to inject fun into it because I think we're so lucky to get to do what we do. We are. So we might as well enjoy it as well. And that's why we have fun together. Exactly. Yay. Yeah.